hi guys welcome back to my channel welcome to a new vlog if you're new here my name is Thelma <laughs> welcome to postpartum vlog <laughs> my baby is currently sleeping She's sleeping and I don't want to make noise. I just finished working out. Bro, guys. This is six weeks postpartum, by the way. I'm going for my six weeks check checkup. Or six weeks check. I don't know what it's called. I'm going to start going to the hospital tomorrow. And I don't know what to wear. I'm trying clothes. And they're not sizing me. <laughs> I've been trying clothes and they're not entering my body. This is the first time I'm going out since I gave birth. Guys, okay, this is what I have ended up with because trousers and tops are not entering my body. But this gown, it's a wrap gown. But <laughs> see what is wrapping. Just very small thing to tie. And this is what my tummy looks like. Six weeks, bro. The breast is breasting. <laughs> this is what my tummy looks like. Six weeks postpartum. I have been tying it. I just started working out like this week, this weekend. But let me go far so you guys will see what the tummy looks like. Okay. This is what it looks like. Six weeks postpartum. I'm trying not to pressure myself, but at the same time, I'm trying not to be too relaxed. You get it? Yeah. I don't know if you guys get what I'm trying to say. I would love to take my time because it took nine months, you know, for my tummy to be that big and carry a full human being. So, I shouldn't be rushing myself, right? Yes. But I am scared of not rushing myself because I'm scared that if I get too relaxed, I might get to a point where it would be it would be too difficult to like, you know, get back in shape. I'll not have to be doing be on a very strict diet going to the gym right now i'm just doing home workouts can't even go to the gym because who will hold this child for me <laughs> if i'm going to the gym right now i have to wash my baby's clothes and um i have to have my bath what else what else do i have to do yeah i have to pump before she wakes up i also want to sleep before she wakes up she already sleeps for like four hours. I think one hour is already gone. <laughs> it's about an hour to like walk out and look for what to wear. So I need to be fast. I need to use the next one hour to wash, have my parts and start pumping. I guess. Okay, can you guys see I've lost a lot of weight? All this excess water on my face has gone. My neck is coming back to color. My stomach is still dark. I need to wear something so I can show you guys what my stomach actually looks like because I've been looking for videos to motivate myself to like see other people's postpartum journey and see what their stomach looked like at like six weeks and to know if the stomach would still go down on its own or if you have to like do some work. I'm not seeing any of that. I'm not seeing a lot of it. So let me show you guys what my tummy looks like for somebody out there might want to know what it looks like <laughs> so guys this is one of the trousers that i tried on i used to wear this trouser to work i used to wear this trouser to work but you see it you know they feel zip you cannot zip <laughs> so my stomach is still dark compared to the rest of my body the smoke is still very dark, but it will fade off with time. Yeah. 
Yes, but it's very tight. I don't know if I'll be able to sit down on this. And look at all this extra tummy. Yeah. My two brothers and sisters. Ah, Lord of Jesus. It's tough out here on these streets. It's tough. Guys, I just finished pumping and eating. I had to do all of that off camera because time was going and I still haven't slept. This was all I got after pumping for like 20 minutes. This is what she eats as a one time meal. So, I'm stressed. This person is actually stressing me. I couldn't even get the full bottle. Anyways, she's moving. guys I want to try to sleep now I still have some stuff that I would like to do but I think I can do those ones later even if she's awake so it's currently 1 35 I want to try to sleep now I'm sleeping on the chair so I can be watching her you know in between sleep and if she makes noise, I can easily hear her. And what does I want to say? Yes, yeah, currently 135. Normally she sleeps for four hours, so I'm expecting her to wake up by two. But I pray that she sleeps longer so that I can get some rest as well. <laughs> I left you, I was sleeping. <laughs> we are ready to go to the hospital. <laughs> oh, 
see our yes. grandma. Yes, I. Yes, I. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. Stuck in the past watching videos of us. I have been trying to get rid of your stuff, but voices in my head are telling me to stop. It's all I have left, all I have of you Thought I was more than a body to hold, baby I wanted you, wanted us to be something more I was so sure, let my guard down for you Baby, why'd you have to love me, love me like that? I gave you my heart and you tore it apart <laughs> What is exciting? Hi guys, how are you all doing? Today is a good day for me. It's a, it's just a good day. Everything just feels good today. <laughs> so I haven't spoken to you guys since I went to the hospital. It's been like four days since then. A lot has happened. <laughs> So when I went for the six weeks check, they just asked me if I had any complaints. They checked my tummy to see if my um, uterus had contracted back to its pre-pregnancy size. Then they, uh, they asked me to go do a pap smear test something to check for possibility of cervical cancer so something like that i shall know it has to do with the cervix and i wasn't able to do it that day so i'll go back to the hospital again to get that done then what else yeah two days later we took Kamsi for her six weeks immunization They gave her five vaccines, two they gave her orally, and then three they gave her as injections. So they gave my baby three injections on her thighs. She was crying, she felt sick, she started running temperature like throughout that day to the next day. She was just crying and sleeping, crying and sleeping. It was it was sad. <laughs> it was sad. And the next day I think in the night that was when she now, you know, started playing again and talking and making all her cute, cute noises. <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, today I've done all my chores. I woke up by like 6 a.m. I did all my chores, washed her clothes, I pumped breast milk, washed her clothes, and did my workouts, had my baths, ate. What else? Yeah, she has also had her baths and it's currently past 11. So, I'm just gonna be chilling. I'm waiting. <laughs> she keeps smiling at me. I'm waiting for her to sleep so I can sleep my own and then wake up and pump again before she wakes up. Mama. Mama. Mama, mama. <laughs> Let me show you guys her face. Come, mama. Come, mama. Do, 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 do.
I want to show you guys progress report on my tummy. Guys, let me show you how much milk supply I have now. My milk supply has improved a lot. This one here is full. It's the highest um, measurement here is 150 ml. That's here, but it is fuller than that. I kept this in the freezer. Then in the fridge, I have these. <laughs> So this she's going to eat now and then there's this that she'll eat in the night, later in the night. Then this one I just pumped it. Now you can see how full the bottle is. I'm so excited. I think I'll start buying storage bags because <laughs> you know they choke. <laughs> you guys, this is Oh, she didn't finish her food. Interesting. This is like how many days after I told you guys that I'm building a stash. <laughs> I was going to buy storage bags. Just look at my fridge. Empty. Look at all my bottles here. All of them. They are right here. Let me show you guys the one I just pumped. This is what I have this morning. It's not even up to 150 ml from both breasts you see this breastfeeding thing i've come to realize that it's not for me i cannot win this game i can't win it i 
I'm done really. I'm tired. Hi guys. Baby has turned herself got her lay her on her on her back. Now she turns herself. See your face. I want to quickly end this vlog guys. Let me show you. I bought this um Jiden wearable breast pump. Since the other one was <sighs> sorry guys, I'm so tired, God. Since the other one was sucking my blood. <laughs> ah, so that one has made pumping easier for me. Although now I'm giving my baby um formula, so I giving her formula. Once I started work, I think I, I'm going through a bit of postpartum hair loss. But you know that normally I don't even have front hair like that. But this one is very obvious. That's my hair in front. So I didn't even do any um, hairstyle since I gave birth. I've not even done any. I've been packing my hair like this. Just relax it and pack it. And see my front hair. On this side, that used to be there for me. It's gone. <laughs> So now I'm wearing wigs every day. I don't like it because the weather is super hot. But because of this hair, yeah, I just wear the wig. What else I want to tell you guys to end this vlog? Yes, I wanted to show you guys my tummy before I finally end the vlog. I've made a lot of progress, but we're not there yet. But now I can wear my trousers comfortably and other things i'm sorry guys i'm so tired i'm drained i need to sleep i really need to sleep i just want Kamsi to sleep so that i can have my bath and sleep as well i'm not eating since morning it's like past four now I only eating snacks i do not have meat by since i started work the stress has has been crazy but regardless let me quickly show you guys my tummy before i end the vlog come mama what why are you telling me yourself you now hmm? you tell yourself and start looking in start looking for help who will help you see why mm. mm. don't cry okay don't cry let mommy show show her people her tummy Oh, my tripod is even there. Come on, suffering myself for nothing. For nothing. What my tummy looks like now is we're getting there. We're getting there. It's almost flat, but not completely flat. Flat and facial. Yeah, flat. I'm thinking flat in my head. Not completely flat yet, and I still have some. Uh, you guys can see excess fat that I have to deal with. I just want that um, gap in my tummy to close completely. Then I will start doing crunches to eliminate all of this excess fat. Yeah. So I was going to wear that trouser again for you guys, but. Come, mama. I was going to wear that trouser again for you guys, but honestly, I, I don't have the energy. I don't have the energy right now. And I just want to end this vlog so I can edit it and push it out. Yeah, because I'm already vlogging again, like a new vlog. I'm trying my best out here, guys. So, there's a lot I wanted to show you guys, but maybe some other time. Thank you for sticking with me. Thank you for watching my vlog. Thank you for watching all my other pregnancy and childbirth delivery related videos. See you guys in another one. Mwah. Mwah.